Welcome once more to this YouTube channel. Kindly subscribe to this channel. The topic is Cancer Genetics and Pharmacogenomics. A topic in medical genetics for biomedical postgraduate students, that's the MSc students. What are the objectives? The students need to understand the cell cycle, angiogenesis and apoptosis. They need to know how genetics contributes to predisposition and pre progression of cancer. They need to understand cell biological and genomic approaches with the eventual target to translate basic outcomes into diagnostics. Right here is an illustration of the cell cycle. You have the G1 phase, that's the phase of cell growth. Then you have the S phase, that's the phase of DNA replication, then G2 phase, and then, of course, M phase, where you have cell division. Then you have cytokinesis and mitosis. In mitosis, you have prophase, metaphase, anaphase, and the telophase. What are the outcomes, the level of knowledge the students need to display at the end of this study? The students need to comprehend epigenetics and somatic genetic changes in tumors. They need to be conversant with basic principles and applications of cell culture and animal models to study cancer. They need to know how immunotherapy is and can be used to treat human illness. Right here is an illustration of cancer genetics and epigenetics. So both the genetics and epigenetics, they, they, they play together to result in a cancer as a disease condition and the progression of cancer. So epigenetics is uh, vital here because it uh, affects the expression of genes. You have processes like DNA methylation, histone modification, and uh, non-coding DNA coming into play here as uh, in the epigenetic uh, process and this plays with genetics to cause cancer and then cancer progresses. We need to appreciate all this in diagnosis and management of cancer. What are the topics? One, introduction to cancer, types of cancer, cytology of cancer cells, characteristics of cancer cells, differences between normal and cancer cells, contact inhibition, Malignancy as a loss of normal cellular affinities. Differential gene expression in normal versus transformed cells. The genetic basis of cancer. Cancer as hereditary change. Next topic is cell transformation and tumorogenesis. Cell cycle checkpoint and cancer. Oncogenes. Tumor suppressor genes. DNA repair genes and genetic instability, epigenetic modifications, telomerase activity, centrosome malfunction, genetic heterogeneity and clonal evolution. Next is familial cancers, retinoblastoma, Wings tumor, Lyfamine syndrome, colorectal cancer, breast cancer, Epstein-Barr virus and its relationship to Burkitt's lymphoma, papilloma virus and cervical carcinoma, genetic predisposition to sporadic cancer. Next topic is tumor progression. The candidates need to be taught angiogenesis and metastasis, tumor-specific markers. The last topic here, but certainly not the least, is pharmacokinetics. The candidates should be taught variations of enzymes in drug metabolism, pharmacodynamics, that's the drug metabolism, biochemical modification, kinetics of drug metabolism, detoxification system, cytochrome P459, N acetyltransferase, succinyl choline sensitivity, glucose 6-phosphate dehydrogenase, debrusoquine, metabolism, alcohol metabolism, heredity disorders with altered drug response, historical aspects of pharmacogenomics, and then pharmacokinetics, drug metabolites, 
pharmacokinetics of drug receptors, pharmacokinetics of drug transporters, interethnic difference in drug responses, genomic variation and pharmacogenomics. Check out other videos on this channel for details of all these topics. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you for listening. Goodbye for now.